Hey guys, this is the Kamloops Gaminators. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me again. Let's start again. Hey guys, this is the Kamloops Gaminators. Back with another video. Also, mission activated. Dun, dun, dun. Today we are. I am going to be reviewing Lego set. R Lego Ultra Agents set River Side Raid set number seven zero one six zero and agent recommended ages seven to twelve and eighty eight pieces in this. See, so um, yeah, let's uh, um, show you the funniest unboxing part I've ever done. Worst unboxing ever, hey guys. <laughs> so yeah, here's here's the set. It's a pretty small scale set, if I do so so myself. It's actually a very good set. Now um. I'm gonna remove the minifigs. Where did I put my thing? Sorry guys, they made a little thing to put the minifigures on. I was just so uh and this put our atten all of our attention to this and you know what? Stick with small then go big. Now you get one instruction book with this. I have all the stuff in here. Now this is the mission. The um two crates that you get. Now um in these crates, if I had my light with me, I'm not sure if you'll be able. To, there's a little um green bit, uh, transparent green thing in it, and that's how they um. And that's the... Now, I think it's pretty cool that they give you two of those. So now, um, let's take a look at this. Now, a little, little um, tip for younger audience. Like, um, if you're in the 7 and, like, 8 area. If you don't know, if you may want to go to your par parents for help for the little... Um, hook and stuff on the back. But, um, yeah, let's uh, take the minifig out. And put him to the side. So, yeah, this is, um, this I got last night. I'm filming this the day after. You guys will be seeing this the day after it goes up. But, yeah, this is, um, River. Side raid um set. Now, um this is a very cool set. This is like a little makeshift ATV. Now when you now I find this pretty cool. When you take Sorry guys, that took all, that took all my both of my hands. So if you look in there, um, I call this a makeshift engine because this is the steering wheel is actually connected in. Like um, you don't actually have it in one thing. Like um, like the steering wheel is actually able. The handlebars are actually able to be retracted all the way to here with this part out. So yeah, I call this a little makeshift transparent blue engine. Lots of transparent blue parts used in the Ultra Agent series. I've um, reviewed two other sets for, um, for it. 
so let's just put the, the back on and take a look at um something that I find pretty darn cool on this. Now you can pop this whole area off, and it and it's meant to be a boat. Now, the way they get this into the water is using the hook on the back, but that's hard. That's a long rope there. And string, piece of string, so I don't want to uh, do, do that yet. So, literally, this is the little boat part of that, which is like the cab. It just disconnects from the actual driving part. Oh, yeah, like my new setup a plane to, uh, yeah, and, uh, yeah. There we go. Sorry, playing around with this. Then you get two stud launching guns. I think you got some extra pieces with this. So, yeah, then, um, this is the little land part of it. To get this back on, you literally see those um, right in front of the two transparent blue ones at the back. You put this on right there. There. And it snaps on like a twig. <laughs> like a pretty darn easily. And... If you want to not have the little propellers down, you can just flip them up. So yeah, I found that pretty cool. So um yeah. That's the um ATV. Now let's get on to the minifigs. Let's bring up my new creation. The minifig shower nine thousand. I made it look like a rocket ship. <laughs> so let's take a look at Acid Aid first. Now, Acid Aid is a very darn cool figure, if I do say so myself. He has, his whole head is transparent. I'm not sure if you guys can see that that well. But his whole head is transparent, except for some parts, except for his eye, his mouth, and a little part right here. Then, um, I really like the design on his shirt. Then they did a lot of design on, on nuts. And this is supposed to be like this. Like his head. But I'm not sure why they didn't do that transparent either. But, that that is, it is pretty cool. And he has a black on. <laughs> so yeah, that's Ace it Aid. And now let's look at the... Agent that I do not know this guy's name. I will look it up on the web. Because I know they gave all the agents names. I just they just don't put them on the boxes, which is a really stupid idea. <laughs> so yeah, this guy has a, a little bit of design on the legs and the chest. And I like his hairpiece. Now this guy does has have two faces, a very serious face, then a, like a Spongebob face. Hi! <laughs> Hi, how's it going? I'm about to jump in the water in my ATV. I don't know why would you, I don't know why you would want to do that, but this guy can do it. So, um, yeah. What's the design? They even put in the design of three little, um, of, um, wrinkles in the top. A tux design on the front. A belt they did on the little front part. So, yeah. Um, I will be rating this. So, um, out of five for this one, I think I would give it a five and a half. So yeah, see you guys, see you later. I'm Gamer Five from the Kamloops Gamers Group. Thing, 
Stay cool and have fun!